Hi, I'm Tad Yates with more pop music trivia. In September of 1969, two fictitious groups had million sellers simultaneously with hits featuring the same lead singer, Ron Dante. Here's part of a conversation I had with Ron. Few people knew it at the time, but you were the lead singer of the Archies on that multi-million selling hit, Sugar, Sugar. And then at the same time, here we are in October, back in 1969, that song was number one for an entire month. And also in the top ten at the same time, you did all of the voices on the Cufflinks big hit, Tracy. That's pretty amazing. You know, it was, you, you keep hoping and wishing as you become a performer that you'll have a one-hit record, one big number one. But uh, as luck would have it, I ended up with two big hit records at the same time with two different groups. Uh, it, was, it was an amazing occurrence, and I, was, I just felt so lucky that I, I, I really had the chance to perform for both groups. Sugar. Tracy by the Cufflinks and Sugar Sugar by the Archies, which was written by Jeff Berry and Andy Kim, who also sang along in the song. Ray Stevens, who was visiting a friend, joined in on the hand clapping during the recording session. And after the Archies for Ron Dante? In the 70s, you, uh, you became the record producer of one of the biggest stars of that decade, Barry Manilow, and often you sang back up on his hits as well. Oh yeah, on every almost every Manilow record that I produced, uh, and that was we did uh, ten albums together, and we had uh, twenty singles in a row that hit the top ten. Uh, the ba- the backgrounds was usually ba- Manilow and myself singing backgrounds. Wow, that's yeah, great! Uh, o- almost on every one, Mandy, Copacabana, I write the songs, Can't Smile Without You, all those hit singles. Join me next time for more pop music trivia, and please share this video. Thank you.